Very in shock. Why are you in shock? <laughs> Big move, mate. Like, yeah, I've got to, I've got to be, give you kudos for that. I was like. tossing and turning whether to do it or not. Yeah. But we were going down a slope where we were just picking off the week, and that just doesn't sit well with me. There was a label on all of us that hurt us. You're old and you've got a bung knee. You're an older, you know, yeah. lady, apparently. Yeah, a surprise. Same as you, you're a mother. Oh, my you're my. old and injured, you're weak, <laughs> and I'm a weak man. Oh. It's just like, who made those decisions? And is that who the only criteria we're going to use? <laughs> who did you hear? I don't need to hear it, I can feel it. I can sense oh. it. I can sense the room, and that's what the vibe was. I stand up when the community needs to be standing up for, and I just felt for why. When I saw her in a, in a state of distress, like she didn't even have an opportunity to shine, I didn't hesitate to save her. <laughs> I just want to clarify though, George, like you just said that no one labelled me as old and injured, but you just did. But that's the perception. So when was your how time... Do you, how do you know that? When was your time to go? If we went weakest to go, who was next after why? Who was next? Way. I don't... Way. 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 I don't... I don't know. You can say I'll get there. You want, honestly. I do apologise. I don't know. It's like... Like... Yeah. Is that how we want to start season six of Australian Survivor? Yeah. Let's just pick out the weak girl. Yeah. Like, I didn't want to start it like that. That's yeah. why I let off the fireworks. <laughs> yeah. Yeah, you <laughs> fucking did, Julia. Really? I'm absolutely grateful you saved me. And I think this really changes the dynamics of the game and the group and that's going to be really really interesting what happens next well welcome back Hello. Hello. Yeah. Hello. who's not with us yeah. Phil's, not here. Phil's not here so why phil i think we're going to get that fire going tomorrow i've got a really good idea okay. we'll do that tomorrow so, why Phil? I feel like, why, why do we need to explain it? There's six of you that don't have Why are these plans dirty? <laughs> it wasn't fun for us, it was devastating to watch a bigger plan. What happened? Can you tell us what happened? Yeah. Like, I don't want to there? indulge oh, a certain person playing? here with that information. I'm enraged, absolutely enraged, infuriated at the stupidity of what he's done. Just absolute snake handler in the grass who is just pure division we and all went along happy with unity because we wanted unity because unity is important moving forward you were the only you were in control and you decided you wanted to blow up the entire tribe if we're going to have a first impressions criteria let's be frank about it what is it what is yours What's my one? Mm. Yeah. Don't judge a book by its cover. It's that simple. Dictator Doctor's a real asshole. He's one of those vultures that stands there with a smile and he talks in a slow, calm voice and then he acts like the victim as if something's gone wrong. No, it's not. It's not, it's not, it's not very simple. It's very mm. it's, it's it's tortuous and confusing. I've been judged, others have been judged, and, you know, that's how it's played out for two days. If Dictator Doctor has a problem with me calling a spade a spade, that's his problem. Dictator Doctor, you're my next target.